All right. <clears throat> what is going on today, everyone? Today I'm going to be opening two Elite Trainer boxes. The Pokemon 25th Anniversary. Um, these are amazing. I like them a lot. I've opened probably eight of them already. I might have a problem. Not sure, honestly. But hey, they're enjoyable. And I like it. We're going to be opening these today. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's uh, get right into it. Let's tear this. all over. These are so nice opening. I really like how they did this, honestly. They're super clean. All right, yeah. We got our packs. We got the base cards that come with it. Energies and stuff. Let's pull this out. Ooh. Okay, let's see this. <clears throat> we have our 10 celebrations. And we have our five other ones. We have, uh, actually, okay, cool. We have two Darkness Ablaze, <clears throat> a regular Battle Styles, the Voltage, and a Chilling Rain. So there's that. <clears throat> then in here we get, you get the booklet. You get some nice, cool looking, just nice basic dice, see through though. Oh, actually, one of the, some of them fell out of the pack. Oh, they're all going to fall out of the pack. Is there a hole in it? Or it's cut open or something? Alright. Yeah, got the dice. Got the pack. But we are... Oh, one second. Let me show you the... Show you the Greninja. Very, very nice. Very nice, actually. And that comes with everyone. <clears throat> All right. We got 10 packs of the celebrations, which, man, hoping to pull that Charizard. And just make sure everything looks good on these. Yeah. All right, <clears throat> let's start with the battle styles. Pretty sure that's the newest, so. I'm not that good at opening these, so. Do not uh, harass me too bad. I'm just gonna throw this crap on the floor next to me, I guess. Oop. One, two, three, four. We're gonna do fire. Nope. Come on, pull something decent, at least a hollow or something. Okay, okay, and a non hollow. <clears throat> All right. First pack, kind of a rip. Let's do, um, we have two Darkness Ablaze, so we're going to do one Darkness Ablaze right now, then we'll go with a Chilling Rain. Ooh, it's open easy. I'm used to them opening so rough. Alright, <clears throat> this might be a good one. To the white and the green, right? Let's do that, let's do card trick one. Two, three, four, and we are going to do hopefully something magical. Hopefully, it's uh, very visible. Hope you can see it. Okay, we got the reverse, and oh, nice, Vickavolt V. Beautiful card, actually. It looks pretty awesome. We're gonna grab a sleeve for that. Alright. See the shine on that? That looks nice. 
What's the centering look? Centering is bad right here. Oof, you see that? It's a chunky thing down there. Probably get a nine. Everything else looks all right on it. All right. First big hit. First big hit. Afterward, I usually I sleeve all my reverse hollows, hollows, and any like the full arts stuff like that. So that's why those are to the side right here. One good hit. One good hit. Said we're gonna go to chilling rain now. Let's get we got a green and uh, white again. One, two, three, four, and this. These are the chilling rains. Hopefully we get something decent here as well. I pulled a uh, Suicune V last night, actually. What's the reverse? Okay. Here it is. Ooh, let's go. Slow King. I've already pulled this one before, though. It's not too bad. I like the way it looks, though. It looks like... That looks crazy, like, the detail in that. All right, we've two, pulled two V cards within three packs. I'd say that's not too bad. We're gonna end on the Darkness of Blaze. I usually have really good luck on them. We're gonna go with a Vivid Voltage. Ooh, okay, okay. Usually when you get a green and a uh, white, it means there's going to be something good. One, two, three, four. Guard trick, flip it over. <clears throat> Hopefully we pull something good. Okay, we got a Slugma, and okay, Togekiss VMAX, that looks crazy, look at the shine. <clears throat> Alright, so out of five of the first packs, basic packs that we get, we have already pulled three full arts, so I would say that's very lucky. We make it four out of five. We got Darkness of Blaze. I like how smooth these ones open. Okay, let's see what it is. Oh no. This one might be a basic one. One, two, three, four, fire. No fighting. Trainer, Finisty, Phoebus. Okay, and a non hollow. Okay. Alright, so not too bad, not too bad. We've opened the first five and we have pulled some actually pretty good stuff. Pulled these three. First five. Very, very shiny. Now we are into the celebration. Let me pick this one. Let me grab the scissors. I like opening these with the scissors. So much easier opening these with scissors. Throw this off to the side. Okay. Cosmon, Dialga, Kyogre, and a Pikachu. Code card. First one is kind of a rip. Ok, 
Okay. Start with Palkia. Just put the co card to the side. Start with Palkia. Cosmog. Ooh, Cleffa. Okay, okay. And a Mew. Not too bad. Not too bad. Just looks. All right, next one. Groudon we start with. And then get a Lugia. A uh, Holo. And a Flying Pikachu V. Not bad, not bad. Uh, <coughs> Another one. All right, and we are back. Let me just back up real quick. Oh well. Palkia and no oh, Cosmog. Oh, these are bad packs. So far, I've got literally nothing good. That Cleffa is like a dollar. Besides when I pulled the first three out of the first first set. Five left after this. Okay, we start with a Kyogre. Saw a little bit of shiny edge. We have a Vettel and oh, Reshiram. Let's go. Not too bad. And a new Lunala. All right. All righty. Sleeve this up. Love the way that looks. Let's actually sleeve these up too. From pack to sleeve. This one is just. So weird. It's like textured. I got a fat boy Pikachu. Alright. Not too bad, not too bad of a pull. Let's try another. <laughs> Sign Vettel. Start with Xerneas. And uh, here comes Team Rocket. Classic collection. This isn't too bad. It's like a dollar, I think, as well. Do this one. <clears throat> Still need a Charizard. I pulled Blastoise, Venusaur. Just need a Charizard. I pulled the Gold Shiny Mew. I pulled the Gold Star Umbreon. Let me just get this code card out the way. I can, I'll use them later. The Xerneas. Oh. Oh, Gold Star Umbreon. There's $80 right there. And we got a Zementa V. $80 card right there. Looks a little chunky on this side, but other than that, it's okay centering. A little thick on the tops, but it's at least probably, probably 50 to 50 to 80, I would say. Not bad. <clears throat> Just talking about it, and I pull one. Beautiful. All right, we got three left. Could be a Charizard, $130 Charizard in here. All right. We got a Ho-Oh to start with. Go card out of here. Pile off the side. Ho-Oh, 
Have a Zerny. Oh, let's go! Grenivore EX. I have not pulled that one yet, and we got a Fat Boy Pikachu. Let's go. This is a new one. I haven't pulled this one yet. That looks so nice. Not sure the price on this one, but I will check. We have two more packs left. One, not including this one. There we go. All right, we are gonna get the code card out of here. Here we go. There's research. Yes. Not bad. I'm pretty sure that's a four dollar card. Um, oof, kind of tough to put in that sleeve. Let me just. There we go. Not bad. Last pack out of this set. Hopefully we get something good. That one on brand pays for the whole box. Mm -hmm. Just the one on brand. Mm -hmm. Let's go. We got a Dialga. We got a Kyogre, ooh, a Veto, and ooh, fine, Pikachu VMAX. Nice, pretty sure this is $4. Let's go. Not too bad, I'll try and put it down there a little bit more. There we go. All right, yeah, that is all for this opening. So, uh, let's see what we got. The for out of the first five packs, we got these. And then out of the 25th anniversaries, we got these ones. So I'll move these out of the way. Pulled the Gold Star Umbreon. Yeah, this is the stack from the first one. These are the 25th anniversaries. Um, these are the, uh, the reverse hollows I pulled. Yeah, thank you for watching.